Some really cute kitties getting help from the community. Oh, you're going to love this. David Martin is live at the Lake County Animal Shelter with more on how you can help these little kitties find a home. Hi, David. Amy, let me ask you a question. Did you know that there's a kitten season? Did you know that it's basically almost in Florida the entire year? <laughs> we'll talk about that in a second, but look at those two cats that Paolo, our cameraman, has found to take home. He already has two cats, so why not have two more in his home? He could do it. Hey, Whitney Bolson, how you doing? I'm fine, thank you. Whitney is the woman who runs the entire shelter here at the Lake County Animal Shelter, and uh, you do a lot of good work for these animals, don't you? We are on a mission to save every savable animal here in Lake County. So. And you do. You have great success right here. Okay, so it is kitten season, which means what exactly? So shelters all over the country are inundated with hundreds and thousands of kittens. Last year, we took in over 1,200 kittens here. So we are gearing up for another really busy kitten season, and we need your help. You do need your help. Uh, how can people help? We would love for you to join us tomorrow for our fosterology class, where you can learn everything you need to um, help us make our little tiny kittens adoptable. One of those things you do is uh, you, you ask people to take them home for about a month and uh, and just what, play with them and get them used to being around humans? Absolutely. So the majority of our kittens come to us um, around the four or five week mark, but they're not big enough for adoption. So they need a safe place where they can grow and develop into adoptable cats. Sometimes they need some behavior help. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> because most of our kittens are born on the streets and that's where they come from. I was going to ask you where they come. Do people bring them in? They do. And we do want to encourage the public not to rush to the rescue. I mean, if there's a mama cat nearby, it is best for the kittens to stay with her. But if they are truly abandoned or if they are um, weaned and ready to come into the shelter environment, we still need to send them out to foster. They need to learn to be loved. And that's where our volunteer um, angry kitten university professors come in. <laughs> I love it. Let's show our audience the perrito over there. That's uh, Boy, look at the eyes closed. He's totally relaxed in that thing, isn't he? Sure. It's a lot like swaddling a baby, and so it helps the kitten relax, and then you kind of force your love on them until they give up, and then they just become sweet, lovable, placeable kittens. Eventually, when the cats get adoptable, I can get, what, a BOGO here? Absolutely. Our cat adoptions are only $10. That includes their vetting, vaccines, and deworming, and you get the second one for free because we like to have BOGO cats in Lake County. This is such a wonderful program you have out here. For all the information, I can find you online, I presume, on Facebook. Yeah, we'd love for you to follow us on Facebook um, or go to lakecountyfl.gov slash LCAS. Sign up to foster a volunteer with us. We'd love to have you. Bob and Amy, I know you guys have a lot of time after the show at night to bring home a bunch of cats, so oh, yeah. do it. Do it today. We'll send it back to you in the David, studio. David, correct me if I'm wrong. Do I recognize that beautiful girl in the red, in the sweater? red sweater? Yeah, I think she looks very familiar. Of course you do. <laughs> Just oh, wait, Alicia. <laughs> Alicia used to work with us at Fox 35, yeah, and I'm trying did. to recruit her back to Fox 35. <laughs> like a doctor, like a kitty cat. That's right. Come on back. Take her back with you. We missed her. As long her. as she brings right. Karitas. That was fun. <laughs>